You will need a wet and dry shock vacuum cleaner, a one inch diameter hose, a funnel, a dead blow, duct tape, dust mask and rubber gloves, and vacuum atmospheres purifier charge part number VAC102691. Hello, my name is Guillermo Torres and I'm with Vacuum Atmospheres Service Department. Today we are going to show you how to replace the catalyst uh, uh, material in the purifier on a uh, OmniLab system. Uh, before we begin, uh, please make sure that you isolate the uh, circulation valves to isolate the purifier from the glove box. Remove the wing clamps, blank off plates, and centering rings from the purifier service ports. Remove the old catalyst material from the purifier using the vacuum cleaner. Now that the old purifier charge has been removed, we will begin to load the new one using a funnel. Load 5 pounds of the molecular sieve into each half of the purifier. Now that we have loaded the first half of the purifier, load another 5 pounds of the molecular sieve to the second half. Gently tap on the purifier walls with a dead blow to level off the charge. This accommodates more room for the other charge to be loaded. Next. Load 5 pounds of the copper catalyst to both halves of the purifier. Load 5 pounds of the copper catalyst to the second half of the purifier. Lastly, load another 5 pounds of molecular sieve into each half of the purifier. Install the centering rings, blank off plates, to both purifier fuel ports and tightly secure them in place with the wing clamps. And that is how you replace the purifier catalyst charge. To conclude, please perform a system regeneration. Before you regenerate, ensure that the oxygen concentration of the box has 200 parts per million of oxygen or less. Vacuum Atmospheres recommends that you regenerate two to three times for optimal performance.